The United Nations High Commissioner for Human Rights condemned the mass executions carried out last Saturday of 81 people convicted of the death penalty in Saudi Arabia. Among those beheaded on March the 12th, 41 are from the Shia minority who participated in anti-government demonstrations in 2011-2012 to demand greater participation in the political process seven are Yemenis and a Syrian, Commissioner Michel Bachelet said in a statement. Bachelet noted that according to information available to her office, some of those executed have been convicted after trials that did not meet international standards. With regard to Yemenis, the executions appear to be linked to the ongoing war in Yemen, according to the High Commissioner. The execution of the death penalty after unfair trials is prohibited under international human rights and humanitarian law and can be considered a war crime. The former Chalian president or Chalian president wrote, Bachelet reminded that the death penalty contradicts the foundations of human rights and that the failure to give information to relatives about the circumstances of the execution can be considered torture and ill treatment and the authorities are also obligated to return the bodies of the executed to their families or relatives. Bachelet also expressed her concern about Saudi law, which includes a very broad definition of what constitutes terrorism and which could threaten to turn criminals who exercise their freedom of expression and their right to demonstrate peacefully, according to AFP.